Welcome back, fellow undead, to another episode of Scholar First Sin. I finally was able to head and start. I was able to clear out the the entirety of the uh, hides tower flame, and uh, yeah. So now we're gonna go beat the uh, old dragon lord, the old dragon rider, excuse me. You gotta be careful with him of uh, man, falling off the edge. Kind of so that I don't know what I already I, you don't have to do that. You don't want to because I actually I actually rose all three uh, I rose all three of the mother fuck Disappear. So that's the old dragon rider. Uh, like I've already mentioned, I'm not hesitating to use any of the uh, summon stones, and I wouldn't. I'd suggest you do it too, because it's kind of fun. Unless you're doing some kind of challenge run, I don't see a reason for you not to do that. So bear that in mind. I'm gonna light this fire up here. How am I supposed to do here? All right. Well, I know I'm not coming over here just yet, so it's not a big deal. I don't. I'm just trying to remember if there's any items down here. Is what I want to know. Yep. Here. Be careful coming to coming there. But I did remember that there was an item at the bottom of the stairs. The monastery charm. Let's take a look at that real quick. Oh man, um... Mm. Where the hell did my monastery charm go? Ah! Alright. Hmm, I don't see it. Not sure. Okay, if I find it, I'll, I'll get into it. Uh, I wanted to point out to you guys, when I was clearing the area, I did happen to grab one of the Hyde Knight Swords. Straight sword originating in Hyde, a special alloy makes it very durable. The composition of the alloy of these swords remains a mystery, but in Dranglaic, the attempt to imitate it resulted in the similar braided steel. Um, I kind of like the Hyde Swords. Uh, they're interesting to me. And then also I picked up the old knight helm, an old undated, undated helm. How old could this nearly crumbling helmet be has extremely low durability. Sometimes just as a thing falls to pieces, it unleashes its last flesh of great power. Uh, and I also picked up the old knight armor. So, uh, yeah, those were pieces that I wanted to show you guys that I did pick up uh, from killing shit in there. I wonder what happened to my monastery charm. The other thing that I picked up was the covetous silver serpent ring plus one. A silver ring depicting the snake, both the servant 
and manifestation of the god of greed, Zandro. Greed is traditionally viewed as a view, but only a fool allows that to ruin a good opportunity. Now, you get that ring from purchasing 10,000 echoes worth of items, or however you want to look at it, from uh, Militia, Militia the Hag back in the Jewel. So if you can, do that as soon as you can. Basically, it's a way to collect more souls. So it's up to you whether or not you can click it or not. This chick right here, why did it touch the blood? I don't want to touch the blood thing. I want to talk to her. Are you from these parts? Are you? My name is Lysia. Lysia? I have come to spread the art of miracles, a practice of which I am a disciple. Now, if you I have a faith that, well that is hired in like the 30, I think it is, she gives you some uh, special items but the and so cost forth, of it. like that, some chimes and things like that. That's for your faith. to decide. But I can't recall, um, I can't recall what it is, though. She'll give you the cleric's chime, I think it is. I think the cleric's chime is one of the things she gives you. She also has this ring of prayer right here that you can buy uh, if you want it to. And she has a ton of miracles. A ton of miracles. Uh, if you're doing a miracle build, uh, go ahead and pick those up. Um, I love the Lightning Spare, one of my favorite. Force is a really good one. Uh, yeah. There, there, there's some really good spells in this game. Uh, but I'd heard awful rumors about this place, and I'm afraid they were all true. true. The king, gone. The earth, ravaged. The burden on the people weighs heavy. I fear that, by now, they may have scarce room in their hearts for miracles. Oh, Lysia, don't worry. Why did I come here? Well... Do I need any other reason than to spread the gospel of miracles? My preceptor always said this art should be shared with the world. Please you. And such is my only wish. Sometimes I fight the urge to pack up and go back home. It is... Well... I must do this. And being out here all alone only makes this a more fitting test of my fortitude. Like a city underwater. I expected this cathedral to be bustling, but there's hardly a soul to be found here. Without any goings on, I'll have to move soon. To a place I could go. Sorry. Help the gullible by teaching the good world. <laughs> Yeah, so that should give you some. I expected this cathedral to a place I could go. Sorry. Not everybody is in the city, right? <laughs> he literally says to you that she wants to move somewhere where she can. Uh, basically, she's, she's trying to trick people. So keep that in mind. That, that's what Lucy is not everything she seems to be. And uh, you're going to find that out later. She will pick up and move from where she is. Uh, and I, I apologize, guys. I've been saying the whole time that the Dragon Riders, I mean, the uh, Hide Knights, should should have become hostile once I killed the Hellkite Dragon. But I was wrong. They become hostile once you actually kill the old Dragon Rider. So we're going to go complete another area really quickly. Hopefully there's some summon signs over here. Uh, and we're gonna have a fight with an uh, old friend, I believe. Yeah. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Doesn't that place up there look familiar? Oh, you know what that probably is, right? At least it looks like what it should be, right? Who knows? Over here. 
not hollow, so I'm not sure why that is. I might die. We'll see. Alright, so I'm assuming, guys, that the reason that they did the... Oh. I want my soul. I assume that the reason why they did certain things with some of the weapons, like, uh, with the, I'm gonna die, that was stupid. Ooh. With the high knife, it's because it was easy at one point in order for you, for you literally, literally to come to the area and farm, um, shit. It was easy to come to the area and farm crack blue eye orbs. Ooh. He, uh, that's what he does. He tracks. That's the thing about Ornstein, is that he tracks really well. Oh shit. I'm not familiar with these ones. Some of this is new, so forgive me, and this is... Fuck! Oh. I'm gonna die, I'm pretty sure. Damn! Oh shit, get out of here. Um You used to be able to get blue uh what is it? Blue cracked blue eye orbs pretty easy from farming the uh farm in the sentinels. So I can only assume that the reason that they that they did that if, if you notice what that is literally the small the small of butt slam that he's doing right there. Got him. Whew. Did not want to have to do that again. You can literally farm the crack. Um... Oh shit. Please tell me these fuckers aren't going to come in here. Certainly looks like it. Oh good, they disappeared. Thank God. You could farm the crack blue-eyed orbs from, uh, from the area. And I guess that made it... Oh, they didn't disappear. Just the light made them shine differently. You could... You could farm those cracked blue eye orbs, which kind of made the thing pretty, pretty easy for you to invade other people's the sinner's world. So maybe that was added as a difficulty layer, so that way you couldn't do it. So we got the cleric's palmer and the tower shield, and then eh, okay, just trying to make sure it's not a mimic chest. I, I doubt it would, be, just in case. Uh, another cracked blue eye orb times three. Okay.
So let's talk to Mamarn Rahur. Transient being. This is no place for one the such one as you. you. I love his halberd and his whole Be outfit. Gone. Shit. You are not needed. Transient being. You would never make a knight of the blue, and I have nothing more to say. Be gone. Yeah, so we he, we really don't have anything to say because in order for him to have something to say to you, you'd have to have actually invaded somebody's world, I believe, in order to make it a value for him to talk to you. And if you come down here, there is a bonfire here, and this is literally where you could come in order to challenge other people, I suppose. Confidence required head. Oh wait, is it because I don't have my ring equipped? Was that what it was? Let's find out. Hold on. Let's get rid of the life ring. I'm pretty sure though that in order to have me, you have to actually have uh, the token inside you. A uh, token on you for defeating somebody that was bothering someone from the way of blue. Transient being, you yeah. would never be gone. Yeah, so I'm pretty sure that's it. But hmm. we got the bonfire uh, lit over here, and we'll be able to talk to him later on. So, yeah, we cleared that area. Thank the heavens. I'm gonna travel back my ass to Majula, and here's the Cathedral of the Blue, and and we have hides. So now we can travel back to Majula, cause thank God we wrapped up that back. I'm going to take care of some leveling up stuff, guys. Uh, but until next time, thank you for sticking around. Remember, as always, hit that link. Like, subscribe, comment. If there's games that you're playing that you think I probably should play, do a let's play a walkthrough of, anything like that, go ahead and hit me up. Let me know. I'm definitely interested in see what other people are playing, and I would like to keep the channel relevant to what the subscribers on here are liking and what people that are viewing the videos are liking. If you're playing something that you don't like, I'll still continue to play. Fuck you. But I'll play also what you think I should be playing. <laughs> Until next time, guys, have fun.